Good afternoon, dear student. In this class, we are going to discuss the potential energy stored in a spring. What is that? So, potential energy stored in a spring. It is a energy stored in a spring in it is in compressed or stretched condition. It is a energy stored. It is a energy stored in a spring. It is in, it's in stretched or, or compressed state. This is called the potential energy of a spring. So this is energy stored in a spring. It is in stretched or compressed state. This is called potential energy energy of a spring. So now we have to derive the expression for potential energy stored in a spring. So derive the potential energy stored in a spring. So let us consider a spring. So this is rigid surface So here we consider a spring of OA of negligible mass, negligible mass, and the first thing we call diagram first. Called X. When the spring is stretched 
structure the it moves a block moves from a to b again this is x now we have to calculate or what is the force should be applied here the what is the work done will be taking place when we apply force when it is stretched a spring so here when we apply some force when stretched a spring the work done will be takes place or take small distance that is dx so at a small distance here uh, the spring is stretched extremely at a small d here distance dx that time the applied force become constant applied force become constant therefore the total the work done by the system when we apply some force uh, at a distance of small distance dx therefore dx equals to sorry dw equals to small amount of work done equals to f into dx f into dx so here now we have to calculate the total work that takes place when we apply a some force to the spring or at uh, at a point x varies from 0 to x the total distance sorry total work done work done when when x varies from x varies from 0 to x equals to x so now the total work done by the system is given by x equals to w equals to integral of x varies from 0 to x of d w so the total work done in the system is equal to integral of x varies from 0 to x dw now substitute the value of dw 0 to x w means f into dx f dx so here in this case applied force magnitude of applied force and is equal to the magnitude of spring force that is that is f equals to kx f equals to kx now substitute here 0 to x f means k into x dx now integrate this integrate this we get here k is the constant take it outside then integral of 0 to x x dx so k integration of x means x square divided by 2 applying this limit 0 to x now therefore w equals to k applying the limit of this i upper limit minus lower limit x square divided by 2 minus 0 divided by 2 that is x square by 2 that is half k x square w equals to half k x square here k stands for spring constant spring constant so now here the work is done when the spring is stretched so here the work done is stored in the form of energy in the spring that is work done can be replaced by potential energy equals to of k x square this is the energy stored potential energy stored in the spring so here potential energy can also be represented by letter u equals to of k x square now we have to find what are the, what is the graphical representation of potential energy of a spring now look at here uh, along x axis we taken as distance distance x along x axis and in y axis f along y axis when the force is applied it get displaced the product of these two gives rise 
दूसरे मर्दन सो इट गिव्स ए लीनियर ह एंड हियर सो ऑब्जर्व हियर व्हेन स्ट्रक्चर एज स्प्रिंग इट इट गिव्स मींस इट डेवलप इट एक्सप्रेस ए वर्टन सो व्हेन वी आर अप्लाइंग हियर अ फोर्स द स्प्रिंग गेट स्ट्रक्चर और वर्क डन विल बी हैपन सो हियर प्रोडक्ट ऑफ दिस टू इज गिव्स रेशियो हियर एफ मींस के एक्स हियर दिस दिस सरफेस दिस शेडेड सरफेस इज कॉल्ड एज के एक्स के एक्स मींस एफ एफ इक्वल्स टू के एक्स सो हियर वर्क डन बाय स्प्रिंग इज गिवन बाय बाय ए स्प्रिंग इज इक्वल टू is equal to shaded region shaded region so here so observe this shaded means this is a look like a triangle therefore the total area of this is gives rise to this is a this is o this is c okay here the total area of this triangle this shaded lines like a uh, triangle or into i into base here base means this is x this distance is x so x into f x into f f means k x k x therefore of k x square this is potential energy u it is represented by graphical and by graphical method also we know that the expression for potential energy stored in a spring is u equals to r k x square this is a expression for potential energy stored in a spring now the variation of potential and kinetic energy and total energy when it is attached to a variable attached to a spring so variation of potential energy kinetic energy and total energy is attached to a the body is attached to spring variable variation of spring spring is a uh, is so let us consider this and is for bending to here so here by this graph this indicate this is o a b c d so here this is the extreme position this is called extreme position this is called mean position this is total energy now this is kinetic energy this is potential energy so this is the graphical uh, picture of variation of total energy kinetic energy and potential energy so look at here so uh, curve a o b gives rise to potential energy here uh, here the potential energy is maximum at the mean position and it is minimum at the extreme position and also here 
the kinetic energy is maximum at the mean position and minimum it is in extreme position now here a a b e, b the line a e b stands for total energy it is constant at all the point from a to b this is the graphical method of variation of kinetic energy potential energy and also total energy thank you